is this thing even on? Guys, I'm back. <laughs> Hey guys, I know it's been a while since I've uploaded a video and if you've stuck around all that time, thank you so much, I really appreciate it. But I am back and I'm going to be making a massive effort to put out at least one or two videos every week. You're going to see vlogs, hopefully gear reviews and everything else in between. It's my goal to build this community and inspire people to get active and that is through the power of running. And for those of you who have been following along, know that in February the 6th, 2017, I set off to run a minimum of 5k every day for 365 days. And I'm happy to report back that I managed to complete that challenge on the 6th of February 2018, uh, which was incredible. And today's video is just a quick update of what happened in my 365 days, as I get a few common questions that people want to know. So we're going to get straight into it, guys, and answer some of those questions that a few of you have been asking about my Run 365 challenge. And the first question that I probably get asked the most is how many miles did I do in the whole year? I managed to complete 1,510 miles in the year and if you're one of those people who like kilometers that is 2,430 kilometers. The next sort of question people always ask me is how many people did I manage to run with uh, that year? Run with style is about community and that was what I started doing about day 50 is asking people to come out on runs with me and if you have seen and followed along uh, and if you stay at the end of this video I will put up a quick highlight reel of all the people and all the photographs that I've took over the year and you can just see all the amazing people that I've managed to run with and that total came to over 400 people which was amazing guys absolutely fantastic and to save this video going on and on i'm just going to go over a few statistics that i've written down it might have been an interest to you guys and some of them are questions that people have had before every run i did for the 365 days was done outside i ran 408 different occasions i ran for over 225 hours i went through three pairs of trainers my favourite route to run was Port Gordon to Spey Bay along the Speyside Way. Uh, I made a video of that and you can see it probably in one of the cards here. The hardest run and probably one of my favourites too was my run up Ben Rinnis. Really hard because it's a big hill uh, and it's pretty steep at points but at the top the scenery is absolutely amazing and also I made a video of that too and if you want to watch that guys I will link that one in the video also. My quickest 5k I managed to do was 20 minutes and 52 seconds. I always fancied doing a sub 20 but never really done the training to get quicker um, so maybe that could be one of the sneaky goals I can put in this year. Other things that might interest you, I never got injured which is absolutely amazing. The only thing I ever worried about is getting injured or becoming ill and not being able to go for a run. And true to the benefits of running, I managed to stay clear of illness and I managed to listen to my own body and make sure on the days that I needed to take it easy, I took it easy and that definitely got me through the whole 365 days injury free which is an achievement in itself because if you've run before it's hard to steer clear of injuries when you're going uh, and doing a lot of running. And if there's something that I haven't covered today folks please leave your question down in the comments and I will answer every single one of them. Remember stay to the end of the video and you'll get to see all the amazing people I ran with on my 365 day challenge. Guys it's great to be back on YouTube and I look forward to putting out videos every week and hopefully it will inspire more people out there to get active together and let's grow the Run With Style community here on YouTube also. Guys, thanks so much for watching. See you in the next video. Jamie, out.